Hello, it's Lori Blakeman again. This is my second video blog or vlog. And thank you to everyone that made suggestions about what they'd like me to talk about or questions they'd like me to answer. Today, uh, we're going to talk about the political spectrum or political ideology that the parties are on and why the leadership races are so confusing about when they start and who's going to be in it. So what we've chosen is... So we've laid out a little visual aid for you here. So what we have is uh, the party that elects the most uh, MLAs forms the government, and the leader is the Premier. So in this case, it's uh, Premier Stelmach and the Progressive Conservatives, who identify themselves as being on the right. Second largest party is the Liberals, and they describe themselves, or I describe us, as being in the pragmatic centre, and the leader is Dr. Swan. Then we have the Wild Rose Alliance, uh, represented by their leader, Danielle Smith. Now, they identify themselves as being far right. So these two really see themselves as going for smaller government, um, less uh, lower taxes, and individuals paying more money out of their own pocket for services, less pooling and cooperative uh, payment of things, so more private health care, that kind of thing. Um, next, we have the uh, uh, Brian Mason with the uh, New Democratic Party, and they put themselves firmly on the left. So they want to see a lot more government ownership of things and a lot more pooling of, of money. And finally, we have the new Alberta Party, who doesn't have a leader at this time, and they position themselves more in here. So those are the, that's the political spectrum. So now for the leadership. So we've had Premier Stelmach indicate that he's going to be stepping down in the fall and that there would be a leadership race that flows from that. And we've also had Dr. Swan from the official opposition indicating that he would be stepping down in the spring and there would be a leadership race. The confusing part of this is that Nobody gets to start their leadership race until the leaders have actually handed their paper over and uh, to their party president. That's when the gate opens and the bell rings and you're actually in a leadership race. And the party can decide how long it is, um, how many public forums there are. They, they make all those decisions. So right now we have two leaders who say they're stepping down in the future, but the race hasn't actually started. But you have had people in the progressive conservatives who've identified they will be running. So so it's quite confusing right now, but also quite lively and uh, uh, generating more interest than we've had in provincial politics for a long time. Hope that helps. Talk to you next week.